I would make a chart here. And I would just put the years. This is the, the end of year one, end of year two, and so on. We know that at the end of the year four, we had this. We're also told that the tr number of trees grows by a fourth every year. If you're growing by a fourth, it means that you multiply whatever you had by five fourths. That's how you grow something by one fourth. That's basically one fourth plus one. So from year zero to year one, you grew by that and so on up until the end. So you had four growth periods. And so if you started with X at year one, you'd have five fourths X. And then you'd want to grow five fourths X by five fourths. So you raise five fourths by one power and so on. You keep doing that and because there are four periods. You end up with five fourths raised to the fourth times X and that equals 6250. And it's got to be that there are at least four fives in 6250 because you can see that the answer choices are integers. So five must divide evenly into 6250 four times at least. So I would be looking for a way to simplify the 6250. And notice that you've got 625 in there. And I know 625 is 5 to the fourth. So that's just going to cancel out, and we're left with 10 times 4 to the 4th, or 2 to the 8th. Sometimes it's easier to think in terms of powers of 2. I know that I know 2 to the 10th is 1024, so maybe I would work my way backwards from there. 512 and 256, so I know that that's 256, so I know that x is equal to uh, 2560. You could also do this question by divisibility. Notice that we're going to end up with a number divisible by 4 because this is being divide, uh, multiplied by 4. You only have two options that are divisible by 4, D and E. At that point, you might have to do a little more, more work. I would probably do part of the calculation so I can see that I've got 625 times 10 and I know that 625 is this is 5 to the fourth so that would cancel and then I know that my unit digit is going to be 0 because I've got this 10 here which means there's going to be a 0 at, at the end of this number which means that it has to be D.